Uh, hello, good people, wherever you are. I hope you have a wonderful day, wherever you're located on our wonderful planet. I have the Potensic Atom SE. There are plenty of videos about this little drone. To my topic for the day is just to go over the little surprises I got when I opened it. On all the other uh, Potensic Atom SE sites that I went, I visited on YouTube, they opened it, but they didn't open it in great detail. I, I knew they probably opened it already, like I did. Now, the thing about me, today is Saturday where I'm at. I got this from Amazon Tuesday. So, basically it's fresh. I did open it, and you know, I got rid of some of the minor packages to see if everything was there. Everything is in here, but I still got some surprises when I open it. And I'm going to go over those little surprises with you when you get your Potensic SE. Or when you get your potential atom, because after this, I'm gonna I'm gonna get the atom. I was thinking about getting the DJI Mini 4 Pro. I'm gonna get that, but first I'm gonna master these. I'm gonna master this. And before I before I got this, I had a super mini drone as you can see right here. The reason I got this this mini mini drone was to get used to flying. See, here's my little controller here. So if you think about getting any type of drone, a high-end drone, this is a higher, my potential, it's a step up. I bought the mini drone just to get used to flying it. So, all right, so now let's open this up. Let's see what we get. When you open it, you get the little potential thing. That's a nice little sign, potential. Let me take this out the box. Here we go. I've seen a number of drones, they came, you know, some type of bag, some type of bag they came with. But the thing I like about the Potensic, not only does it come with a bag, it come with a shoulder strap. Now, other drones that I reviewed before I got the Potensic, they always had a little, they had a little, some type of little pop, carrying case. But having this shoulder thing is a winner because, you know, you get tight. When you got it in your hands, your hand is tied up. When I have it on my shoulders, my hands are free. So, let's continue. So I'm gonna open it, and we're gonna go over the surprises I got when I opened it. Now, when you open it, you see only three things. When you looked on Amazon, you had about several items there, so you had to go hunting for those several items. The first one is pretty self-explanatory. You get those cables. You open the zipper, and you see you got your little cables there. Your cables, the cables, um, the extra propellers, etc. So that wasn't too bad finding that. Then I took out step one. Here's my little drone. It feels nice. This, but this is my first drone. My first drone. Or first professional drone. Because you saw I had the mini, mini drone. But this is my first drone of, you know, of some stature. And here's the controller. Now, the controller. To me, it feels like a quality control. It got some weight to it. It has some weight. The drone, it feels like this controller, it feels like it's like a pound or so. And the thing I like about the controller, it can go in and out like this. Most of those drones that you've seen when they had the cell phone attached, they had the, the, the cell phone out here. I don't like that. To me, it feels more professional when I can, and I like that little effect like that. So you see, it's very adaptable. So it will, it will hug your phone. You see that? It will hug it. So I'm gonna put my phone in there. It feels very quality. Now the thing I, th uh, the reason I think I really liked it, because it remind me of my Nintendo Switch. See, <laughs> look at this. That's why I think I really liked it. Cause I said, oh, it remind me of my, my Nintendo Switch that I played that many times. So I'm used to my switch, so I'm gonna definitely be used to have my phone like this, and it does feel quality. Like you see, look, look at this. I can let go, the phone won't come out. I'm going on like this. With them other <coughs> one with the phone up here, I don't know how secure the phone is. I know it's secure, but I don't know. I don't know how because somebody can hit it, the phone come out. You can do something dumb. You can hit up something, the phone come out. But here, you know, the phone is embedded inside that. I like that. But that's it. It looks like my Nintendo Switch. Alright, so we took out the drone. 
Next thing, and I took out my uh oh my controller. But then I was saying, where, hey, where the battery at? Look at here. Where the battery? Okay, where, where the battery at? But this what you gotta do. See that that was the biggest thing I was saying. Where in the world them batteries? I don't see the battery. You got it's like a little it's like a little uh piece of cloth in here. You gotta lift this piece of cloth up, lift it up out of here, and inside you will have your two batteries. Like I said, when all them other sites I reviewed about the Potensic, they never told you that your battery is hidden. So Thank you for stopping by. In a couple days, I'll be making videos of me flying my drones. I may add it, I may append it to this video. So, thank you for stopping by, but I said, that was the surprising element. You have to, your battery is inside of here when you get it, but there's a little flap in there. And when you first get it, <laughs> you don't notice the flap. You don't notice it until you actually look hard and say, let me lift this up and look for my batteries. All right, so that's it, people. But if you get the potential, I hope you enjoy it, and I'm sure I will. This is my first professional drone. After this, I may go up to the potential Adam with the gimbal on it. Then after that, I may get my DJI Mini 4. Thank you for stopping by. Take care. Peace.